There is a belief that the ancestors of the Lao people were Nagas and they stayed to safeguard and delivered fortune to their descendants. In return, to show respect, Lao indigenous peoples incorporate images of Nagas into their lives. They have Nagas everywhere, at the temple, at home, on their houseware items and on their clothes. The Naga symbol comes in different shapes and forms and they are made of various materials related to various purposes and ceremonies. Here you see the monks and villagers making a boat in the form of Nagas, which is for the preparation of Ok Pansa festival, or known as the ceremony for the end of the Buddha Lent. The Naga design is also woven into textiles. Weaving the Naga motif into cloth requires several work processes from yarn making, spinning, dyeing, making the warp, setting up the loom, creating the pattern and weaving the cloth. Traditionally, the body part of the Nagas is mostly woven in natural white yarn with the crest predominating in powerful colours, which is to demonstrate the supernatural powers it possesses. The dyer must therefore prepare symbolic colours, such as red, green and gold. Weaving is a cultural heritage that has been passed down from mother to daughter in oral form for centuries, but recently many weaving studios and family cottage industries in Laos have started to organize training courses in order to preserve and promote the tradition. Setting up the loom needs lots of time and patience. After making the warp, the weaver has to attach each yarn one by one into the weaving equipment. It is the fundamental process to give a perfect texture. All the arms should be arranged in the right order and at the right tension. To create the Naga motif, the weaver should plan ahead. What technique she will apply? It can be eye cut or supplementary weft or warp and if she will prepare the design by making an illustration or following the pattern from an ancient masterpiece. The weaver has to work carefully with the position of the design and with the number of threads. In making a motif, if the count of a single yarn is missed, the whole design will go wrong. She therefore has to concentrate on the counting with a lot of attention especially for the first line of threads. To keep the motif repeatable, after picking up every line of motif, the weaver will store it into the long heddle. It works like a memory chip of a computer that the weaver can get back to and reuse whenever she wants. To complete one Naga design might take several days, with the weaver repeating the same process of counting the yarns, picking up the design and storing. The Naga design is considered as one of the most delicate and prestigious patterns of Lao woven textiles that every exceptional weaver should be able to do. The value is not only due to the technical intricacy, but the Nagas have been part of people's lives for many centuries, which is not only a cultural heritage, but also a spiritual heritage. <laughs>